Hello and welcome to another Igloo Imaging tutorial. This one is on live text gradients. Uh, in the past I've had to convert my text to outlines and then apply the gradient. Um, but obviously once you do that you can't then go back and edit the text. So this is a little quirk of Illustrator that allows you to do that. So I'm going to go ahead and go onto a new artboard. All I've done here is press T which is type and I've typed out live text gradient. So now what I'm going to do oops, now what I'm going to do with this selected is take away the fill color. So it's at the minute it's white. So if I take away the fill color, it becomes invisible. Now the windows you're going to want to open are appearances and gradient. And once you've got those open, we can crack on. So with this still selected, it's invisible. I go up to my appearance window and I click this button here, which is add new fill color. It changes it to black. Now once it's black, I can then apply a gradient to it. So I go to my gradient tool, hit gradient, nothing's happened. I just hit one of my preloaded gradients or I can hit the gradient bar down here. Yours might be defaulted to black and white and now it's applied that gradient. You can go for a linear one, a radial one. You know, you can edit the gradients with the slider bars in the normal way that you would do. But ultimately the best thing about this is if I press T and go into this text, it is still live and it will apply the gradient over the text as I type. I can get rid of it and start again and it still applies it. And then if I come out, I can go back to the gradient panel and again, I can change it to linear, radial, whatever I want to do. So that is a great way of using gradients on live text. I hope that was useful. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you again next time. Thank you.